In today's video, I'll be showing you how to install Easy Anti-Cheat in Windows 11. So to be able to do this, first you need to already have the game downloaded and installed that you would like to install Easy Anti-Cheat for, because you cannot actually download Easy Anti-Cheat setup file from the internet, we got to run the setup file within the games folder. So I have two games for the example in this video, but there's one thing you can do first to ensure Easy Anti-Cheat is installed for your game. So if you open up File Explorer, and if you then go to your C drive, and if you now open up Program Files, and then X86, you will see an Easy Anti-Cheat folder in here, if you do have Easy Anti-Cheat installed for one of the games on your computer. And as you can see, I do not have an Easy Anti-Cheat folder, which means Easy Anti-Cheat isn't installed for any of my games. So to install Easy Anti-Cheat, you now need to go to the location of one of your games. So like I said at the start of the video, I'm going to be using two games for this example. The first game I'm going to use is Fortnite. So I'm now in the Fortnite game, I'm in the binaries, Win64, and then there's an easy anti-cheat folder, which I've gone into. You now need to open up the easy anti-cheat setup file. So there will be a .exe file that says easy anti-cheat within your games folder. Double click onto it, and it will then say current game. You now need to select install easy anti-cheat, and this will then install easy anti-cheat for that game. So I'm now going to press install. And as you can see, it's now successfully installed Easy Anti-Cheat for Fortnite. So I can now press Finish. If I now go back to my program files, as you can see, there is now an Easy Anti-Cheat folder that's been created today. If I go into this folder and double click on Easy Anti-Cheat, you can now see I can select a game and it's game 217, which is Fortnite. So Easy Anti-Cheat has now been installed for that game. But there are no other games in the list. So now if I close down Easy Anti-Cheat and if I open up my other game which is Apex Legends. So if you're installing an Easy Anti-Cheat for Apex Legends you need to go into the games folder. You will then see an Easy Anti-Cheat folder. You then need to open this and you will then see the Easy Anti-Cheat setup file. We then need to open up this file. So like I said, in the games folder, you will see an Easy Anti-Cheat folder if that game uses Easy Anti-Cheat. So as you can see, by default, it's now selected Apex Legends because I'm about to install Easy Anti-Cheat for Apex Legends. This setup file is slightly different to the Fortnite one because if I click on the drop down, I can actually select from a list of games which game I want to install Easy Anti-Cheat for. But like I said, for this video, I'm doing it for Fortnite and Apex Legends. So I now need to go ahead and press Install Easy Anti-Cheat. As you can see, it's now finished, so I can press Finish. And if I now go back into my program files, and if I now double click on Easy Anti-Cheat, if I now select, the list has changed because I used a slightly different Easy Anti-Cheat setup file for Apex Legends. So if I now scroll down and select Apex Legends, you can see that it says Repair Service, which means Easy Anti-Cheat has now been installed for that game. If I was to select a random game, you can see it doesn't say it's installed for that game. But if I scroll down and if I find Fortnite and select Fortnite, you can see it's installed for that game as well. So that is how you install Easy Anti-Cheat in Windows 11. I hope this video helped you out and you enjoyed it. If it did, click the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.